in this series, I'll be showing you the best methods to max your account with Ghost Mouse. Personally, I use my own custom mouse recorder that stores and plays back multiple recordings randomly with added randomization, breaks, and color clicking. But the same methods will still apply. In this episode, I'll be showing you what I did for wood cutting and some alternatives. For the early levels, just cut normal trees until 15, and then switch to oaks, willows, and then maple trees. The trick to mouse recording wood cutting is to only click tiles where your character won't move whether the tree is up or not. This way, it doesn't matter when the recording plays to click the tree. Make sure you use the Moonlight Camera plugin to expand pitch limit so you can make the camera vertical. This makes it easier to click the tiles that won't cause your character to move. An important step is to find a spot with two or more trees reachable from the same tile, so you never have to move and can alternate between multiple trees. Having more trees means you can vary your click location more for better randomization. Using the OSRS wiki, there's an interactive map for every tree type, so you can easily find trees that are grouped together. Ideally, find a spot that doesn't have too many people, since having multiple people cut your trees down means more chance you'll click a tree already cut down. An alternative to maple trees is hollow trees. They give slightly more experience per hour and you won't run into any other players as no one chops these. I wouldn't recommend the blisterwood tree since the AFK time is actually much worse than other types of trees. On average, you will only cut 10 logs before you stop chopping, rather than a fixed minimum time. Teak trees, although fast EXP, you won't easily find a spot not already taken by another player. I also wouldn't recommend redwoods as you can't reach multiple spots from the same tile. You only need one of these methods to max woodcutting. For me, that was maple trees. Most people think woodcutting is a tricky skill to macro, but once you know the trick, it's extremely easy. In future episodes, I'll keep covering every other skill and money-making method I use to max my account and build my cash stack.